Hello. We are going to make a car. Inflate one balloon leaving about two inch flat tail to make the body of the car. Twist the first soft six inch bubble. Lock both ends of the first bubble in one lock twist. We made the front of the car. Twist the second soft two inch bubble. Lock both ends of the second bubble in one lock twist. We need the second bubble to hold the wheels, the front wheels and the front of the car in fixed position. Now let's fold the balloon three times. Make the last third of the balloon about four inch longer than the first two thirds. Hold the first third and twist uh, at this point the third bubble. Measure the size of the fourth bubble. It should be the same as the third bubble. Twist the fourth bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. The next fifth bubble we have to twist about two inch longer than we twisted the fourth or the third bubble. But first of all let's get rid of the flat tail at the end of the balloon. Squeeze the balloon. This way you force the air to the end of the balloon. Now we twist the fifth bubble. In this example I made the third and the fourth bubble eight inch each. So now I have to make the fifth bubble about ten inch. Lock the free end of the fifth bubble between the third and the fourth bubbles. At this point it looks like we made a threefold hat. Now we have to make two more bubbles. The next sixth bubble could be of any size. Just make sure to make the seventh about um, one inch bubble at the very end of the balloon. Lock both ends of the sixth bubble in one lock twist. Uh, the last seventh bubble represents the um, head of the driver. So let's put the seventh bubble, uh, the driver, uh, where it's supposed to be inside of the car. Fix uh, the fifth bubble um, at the front of the car between the third and the fourth bubble. Ok, we made the body of the car. Bottom view, the side view, the front view. We used one balloon to make the body of the car and now we're going to use two balloons to make the wheels. We can use any dark color balloons to make wheels. Inflate two balloons leaving four five inch flat tail. Twist the first soft five inch bubble. Uh, you can twist bigger bubble if you want to make a uh, larger size wheels. Lock both ends of the first bubble in one lock twist. Twist the second soft two inch bubble. Twist the third soft two inch bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Lock both ends of the second and um, the third bubble uh, in one lock twist. The second and the third bubble uh, will hold uh, uh, the wheel in a fixed position. Something like that. Twist the fourth uh, two inch bubble. Twist the fifth soft two inch bubble. Uh, I forgot to mention that um, we use one balloon to make a pair of wheels. Lock both ends of the fifth bubble in one lock twist. Later we are going to use the fifth bubble to attach uh, this pair of wheels to the body of the car. Twist the sixth bubble the same size as we did the fourth bubble. Twist the seventh bubble of the same size as we did the first bubble. Lock both ends of the seventh bubble in one lock twist. We made the second wheel. Make sure you made uh, the same size wheels on one pair, more or less. Twist a chain of two soft bubbles of the same size as uh, 
we did the second and the third bubble. Lock both ends of the chain of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Now we lock all ends of the last two bubbles in one lock twist. Well done. Now we have to cut off the rest of the balloon and tie off the end. We have made a set of two wheels. We can fix uh, wheels in different positions. In this example, the second third and um, the sixth and seventh bubbles stay on the uh, top of the wheels. We can force the second bubble halfway through the loop of the first bubble inside of the wheel, leaving the third bubble on the top of the wheel. Let's fix the sixth and seventh bubbles in a similar way on the other wheel. Ok, it looks good enough to me. We have to make one more set of two wheels. Here I made exactly the same wheels, uh, but you can make uh, smaller or bigger size wheels for the second set. Now we attach wheels to the car. Let's start with the front. Lock the fifth brown bubble with the second blue bubble. After you attach the wheels to the car, uh, you have to fix the fifth brown bubble at the bottom of the car. Ok, that's a front view and this is bottom view. Now we attach the second set of wheels to the rear of the car. Lock the fifth brown bubble with the sixth blue bubble. Then fix the fifth brown bubble at the bottom of the car. Fix all bubbles in proper positions. So we made uh, some sort of uh, racing sport car. Previously I published instructions uh, how to make a car that looks more like a jeep. You can find links to all instructions at our website viewdoit.com. There are a number of modifications we can make to this sport car. For instance we can change the way we made the front uh, or the rear of the car. As I mentioned before we can make different size wheels for the front and the back, the rear wheels. Congratulations, we have made the car. Most kids love hot red racing cars. So here's the one. I use dark blue balloon for the wheels, red for the body. Looks good to me. Have fun and happy twisting.